One day, the universe will die. But why and how? And will the universe be dead forever? Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Sean from Promotion TV, and welcome to another episode of the YouTube Buzz. Now we all know that YouTube is great for entertainment videos. They're also really good for educational videos as well. So in this video, we're gonna take a look at five YouTube channels that will make you smarter. ASAP Science is one of YouTube's top science channels. They're also Canadian. Now this channel utilizes pre-drawn visuals. The videos are quick and easy to digest. And they put things together in a nice, neat package so you don't waste a lot of your time watching through a lengthy video. Which is great if you just want a quick educational video to watch. Now the guys behind ASAP Science are Mitchell Moffitt and Greg Brown. To capitalize on the success of their channel, the two recently released a book, which I'm sure their 3.7 million YouTube subscribers will definitely appreciate. Now the name of this next channel is a little bit difficult to pronounce. Kurzgesagt, which in German means in a nutshell or in short, according to Google Translate. Now this channel, like ASAP Science, also includes animation. And I find that when they use animation, it makes things a whole lot easier to understand. Now Kurzgesagt captures the imagination of its viewers by offering crazy content like videos titled Three Ways to Destroy the Universe. Now the channel is probably the newest in the list, starting in July of 2013, and it already has over 480,000 subscribers. So if any of you guys watching this are actually German or how to speak German well, let me know if I'm actually doing a good job at pronouncing the name. Up next we've got Crash Course. Now the channel is run by John and Hank Green, who apparently are pioneers in the vlogging of science and educational related video content. And Crash Course talks about everything that's related to the world of science. They were talking about history, chemistry, biology, psychology, sociology, and the list goes on. Now the cool thing about this channel is that they actually encourage teachers and professors to use their content in their classrooms as either additional educational videos or for homework. The channel currently has approximately 3 million subscribers and over 200 million video views. And now onto my personal favorite, Vsauce. Vsauce is hosted and owned by Michael Stevens. And he has a really cool way of tackling seemingly impossible questions. And it provokes a lot of thought. And some of the subject matter is pretty weird, which makes things that much more interesting. Now Michael Stevens has done quite well for himself, starting up two other channels in the Vsauce network, Vsauce 2 and Vsauce 3. And he's also been featured on numerous television shows. Now if you guys are YouTube content creators, you guys probably have already heard about Michael Stevens or has seen his face in the YouTube creator section. Now Vsauce currently has a wide 8.5 million subscribers and over 770 million video views. All right, so let's take a look at Mental Floss. Now this channel is primarily operated by John Green. And Mental Floss is actually the YouTube channel of a magazine of the same name. And John Green is still an active contributor to the Science Magazine. Now when the magazine decided to start a YouTube channel, they looked no further than John Green. Now Mental Floss has since expanded with hosts, featuring individuals like Elliot Morgan, Craig Benzine, and Michael Stevens from the previously mentioned Vsauce channel. Mental Floss started back in October of 2011 and currently has approximately 2.5 million subscribers. And just like that, there goes another episode of the YouTube Buzz. So do me a favor and leave your comments in the comment box below and let me know which one of these science channels are your favorites. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel, give this video a thumbs up, and if you want to find me on social media, you can find me on Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, and Google+. And I'm also on Instagram. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. So what will actually happen to the universe in the end? At the moment, heat death seems the most likely. <laughs>